Yo, what is going on? Brennan here with Atlas Stationers coming at you live from Chicago. It is Wednesday, October 18th. It's a polling order kind of day. Order polling kind of day. Yeah, well, so we've got a boatload of orders here for you. Um, this is from the queue uh, starting last week through the weekend up till now. So if a lot of you are watching, you're gonna see your order be pulled today. Uh, before we jump in, y'all always know the deal, some big announcements. Uh, Fountain Pen Day is about two weeks away. Uh, we have a ton of things lined up for our shop on that day, November 3rd, as well as online. So you can obviously participate in person or you can follow along on social media as we go live and create a ton of different content as well as show off uh, and introduce a few of our special guests that day. We'll be having Fountain Pen Day founder, Carrie Yeager himself here in the shop, flying in from New York. And then the pen addict, Brad Dowdy, be flying in as well so it's gonna be packed there are so many of you who already basically reserved your seat we're doing a, a live podcast kind of deal uh, where we have seat reservations that's totally free it's almost completely sold through though there's only a couple left so head to our website atlasstationers.com if you want to reserve your spot uh, outside of that we've got the diamond ink vent calendars due into us i believe today so if that shipment comes in while we're live we'll run to the back dock and see if we can give you a live preview of it otherwise once it gets in we're gonna have our team working around the clock to start shipping them out immediately uh, uh shipping them out immediately starting friday starting so, friday oh you can't even release we can't friday. release it until friday yeah I, october eager, tw guys. october 20th so we'll start packing them up you might get a shipping notification early uh, yeah. before Friday, but they won't actually get dropped off to UPS or USPS until Friday yep. at the earliest. Um, but yeah, hopefully it gets delivered. It's on the truck for delivery today. I think it's a pallet or two. It's it's insane. Wow. Yeah, it's so gotta, it's gonna come through the back dock, and uh, we had tons of pre-orders. So uh, in an effort to try to stay ahead, we'll start packing them. Yep. Not so, officially shipping them. Yeah. So we've pre-sold probably close to eighty percent of what we're getting. Um, so if you haven't gotten yours yet, you want to be part of that uh, opening batch, make sure you get those pre-orders in. Uh, once we sell out, we will not be getting any more. Uh, so it's a one-shot deal for, for it this year. I think the biggest challenge that everyone's going to have is who is going to be able to hold and not open their infant calendar until December 1st. I have a feeling the vast majority uh, will start opening up. So one piece of advice, be careful when you're browsing social media, the Reddit forums, people will start opening up immediately. Some don't have the, uh, the due diligence or the respect to say spoiler alert. So just be on the lookout, you know, you don't want to spoil anything for yourself. Cause it's a lot of fun opening it up every single day, seeing a brand new, never before seen, newly released ink from Diamond. So um, speaking of that, one last thing, uh, our Discord channel is popping off right now. If you want to join, hit us up. We've got a server full of a ton of great people from the community, all offering assistance, showing new products, hauls that they purchased, all that good stuff. And there is actually a channel, a tab for spoilers. So I imagine there might be a few people that may post in there. I mean, I might advise against it, but uh, hopefully they use our spoilers channel because that was made in like, in particularly for the Ink Bank calendar. Um, are we good, by the way? Yeah, we're good. We got we're uh, good crew here. Cool. Everyone's saying hello yeah, we're, to each we're other. An hour later than what we normally do, but we had a phone call with a, a brand overseas, so a, a new manufacturer to us. So. Yeah, that we've been working on for a little while. So hopefully, we'll have some news on a opening order for that brand that we can share in the near future. Awesome. So y'all know the drill. You place your order online, you leave an order note at the checkout screen asking to be pulled or packed on TikTok. We then offer our services to do a live showing of us pulling or packing your order. Today is a polling video. The first one we've got is Roxy S, order number 127204. Uh, this one we had to pull ahead of time just because it was a special order for a Visconti pen. We've got the Violet Blue Ink from Graf von Faber-Castell. And then this is the Dark Crystal with a medium nib. Now, this is a sweet pen. It's in the Homo Sapiens line, made out of volcanic lava rock from Mount Edna. Um, one thing Roxy did ask us to do is to dip test the nib, uh, which we have no problem doing at all. If you ever want us to look at the nib uh, before we ship it out, we can have our team do that for you. Yeah, we do try to offer that only for uh, some of the higher end pens. 
Yes. Um, so there is a, a limit to us dip yes. testing. Yes. Don't those. order twenty Twisby Ecos and ask us to open them up. We probably won't be able to do that because those come sealed. But for you know individual isolated situations, we don't mind, especially on the high end stuff, as Brian mentioned. Yep. So Roxy, you are all set. We're throwing in some of the Atlas Floral Inkwell stickers with every order today. That is pulled on TikTok, and then the Fountains of Atlas. Thank you for filling up. Boom. Yep. First one done. Yeah. <laughs> Tanya saying dip test my uh, Perkeo. Yeah, I, if you really wanted me to, <laughs> I, I would film. I would use that one as an example to film on TikTok how we dip test pets. There we go. But yeah, I guess I almost spoke too soon because we'll, if we open up the door, the door to that, everyone will ask us to test <laughs> every pet. So we don't have the capacity to do that, but we do actually inspect every pen and we take off every single cap to look at the nib to make sure we got the right nib size and that there's no uh, obvious defect with the product. So we do that with every pen that we send out. Yeah, um, do our best at least. To the best we, of our ability. Yeah, so I uh, got a comment, been really tempted by the Crystal Dream, which is the cousin to the Dark Crystal. That another great, more. yep, another great model. Uh, had somebody asking us to send the Discord link. So anyone that wants to join the Discord, you can go to any of our social media channels, TikTok, Instagram. Uh, there should be a link tree mm -hmm. that you can click on that has a link to that invite so that you can get in there. Uh, if there's an issue, let us know. We can always send that back out. Looks like Kelsey was able to send it, that to the person that was asking, so all good there. Uh, speaking of the Groff on paper castellings, are some of them permanent? I don't think any of them are permanent. At least the ones we carry. Yeah, I'm pretty sure none are permanent. All right. So. Okay, on to the next one. This one's for Gloria C, order number 138388. We've got a lot of cool stuff on here, some accessories and some inks. So let's go ahead and start pulling. Let's read the order note. Hello again from the The Heimdall, which is the newest one, and the J. Iyer, I think that's how you pronounce it. This is all literature stuff that you probably get. Yeah, and I think those came in on Friday, so I'm not sure if you were able to show them when you went live last. But I we did. do, okay, oh, so wait, no. uh, we did just get two new wearing gold inks. I can't remember. I know we, we trained in the stat on it, but I can't remember if I Yeah, we might it. not have, but uh, I know we're working on getting it swatched. They are on the website now. But we'll get that swatched, and I just ran it into the pole because Brennan's right, having me walk you. all the way around. I, I thought you felt it. Yeah, I felt it when yeah. I ran into it. My bad, my bad. It's it's okay. Tanya says, can't hear you. Check your mic. I think mine's good. Is yours good? Yeah, mine's on. Yeah, I think ours are good. All right. Oh my goodness. Let me get a different one. You got Alan in here. Oh, I need a new fountain pen. You sure do. 707107. So this is the tan round pencil case from Claire Fontaine. And Brian, you have to do a little 180 action. There you go. I got to do that time. Doing the black wing red pencils. And then the three point guards right here. And Gloria, that's going to do it for you. Thank you for the love. Yeah, and the chat is saying the background noise is louder than normal. I hear more background than your voices. Hey, Alex, can you turn the music down a tad? I wonder, maybe it's because we were just sobered by the register. Maybe. Or it's time for new mics. You know, as we continue making content, we start investing, uh, you know, in, in some, some upgrades. We're looking to uh, upgrade our setup for Fountain Pen Day, though, during the live broadcast, so that should be really fun. But I don't know, oh, it's me? Brendan's mic, Tanya said. It's all your fault. It's my mic? Yeah. Can you hear me? Mic check, mic check. I don't mind holding it close if I need to. Maybe I can latch it. And uh, while you're trying to figure that out, are wearing gold inks limited since they come out with new ones every month? Uh, no, I don't believe they're limited. They do discontinue some on occasion. Uh, I think some of the poor performers, uh, but so far anything that's come out in the last year and a half has not been discontinued, minus one special edition collection. Uh, but anything that you're seeing now, they should be in production at least for a while, nothing limited. 
one is for Melissa S. Order number 138062. We've got a big note here. Hey y'all, thank you for pulling my orders live. I love it. I guess I missed my job managing the manufacturing warehouse of my notes for art museums and online web retailer. You all have done so much for the Bowtech community. It feels like a virtual magnet. If you don't mind, I'd love it. A sticker signed by Brendan Bryan or Mama T. We gotta get you a sticker. So they don't think your mic's working. So, oh, are you serious? Yeah. So you're I'm hearing switched. us? Yeah. And then you just talk. Yo, can you hear me? All right, well, the new setup is if Brian reads a comment, I'll reread it out loud so you guys know what we're addressing. Let me know if that's better, though. Let's confirm that that's better. Nope, it's not work. Uh, it's not working. Let's right, take let's this. Do no mics. It's... All right. Take that out. Hang on. We're gonna do no mics. You gotta stay here. Or you gotta stay yeah, close, close to me, I mean. Can you guys hear us now? Hello, hello. I think I'm the one that's gotta walk backwards and not talk in front of the camera. Yeah, Tanya. I don't know. I haven't, yeah, they can hear us. So it's just not gonna be as clear. Uh, Tanya said, I broke your mic in retaliation from my Esty for not ordering her silver trim sea glass. That's crazy. Way to go, Tanya. The resentment. That was, yeah. the resentment. Okay, let me restart with this order. This one is for Melissa X, order number 138062. Got a whole bunch of really cool stuff on here. The note says, hey y'all, thank you for pulling my order live. I love it. I guess I missed my job managing a manufacturing warehouse of items for art museums and an online web retailer. You all have done so much for the Fountain Pen community. It feels like a virtual family. If you wouldn't mind, I'd love a sticker signed by Brendan, Brian, or Mama T. So Brian's gonna be the one to sign this sticker. I appreciated the shout out as a regular supporter. The reason I say I stay is because you truly make us feel included at every turn. It's so much fun. I'm waiting to hear on the 20th if I'll be attending the podcast or not. The doctors have final say next Friday. Thank you for including me in the fun and my shout out last Friday. It made my day knowing you've noticed I've been a supporter of y'all. Thank you and stay safe. Melissa, what a great note. We love you. We appreciate it. Uh, so I did already pull this one, the new Magellan ink. We need... The Herbal Magic Sticker Box, the tin, from Cora Crea Crafts. The Inner Epping Peace Sticker Book. Can't say that one on live. The Midori Art Stickers and the Midori Green. You see right here. The Letterpress Set. So these have all the individual letters as stamps. And then, Brian, it is the 18th. The deadline to order this month's box is tomorrow. tomorrow. So I don't know if you want me to show it. There is a sub box on here. Uh, no, I don't think you. we should show it yet. Uh, I think we can show it. Well, I guess we can show it. Captain Morgan. Captain no, Morgan we, right now. we probably need to wait till Friday. Okay, then, uh, Melissa, we cannot show the, the box you ordered, the subscription boxes. We have people still waiting to receive it. We don't want to spoil it. So that's going to do it. And then we should probably make a trip to the back here and bring some of these back so that we're not leaving them on the pen cases. Here, here, let's move them over here. Yeah, Melissa just uh, enabled someone, oh, adding alphabet stamps to my wish list. Nice, yeah, it's just a fun little set. Yeah, it's always fun seeing some other items that are ordered that we can pull outside of just pens and inks. We've right, got you know what, let's move all of this. We're just going to clear off this case, you guys. Oh, no, no, sorry. <laughs> Trying to stay close so that we can both be heard. Yeah, sorry about the mic deal. I guess that gives me a reason to go on Amazon. Yeah. I will. I'm, I'm going to kind of spoil it for you, Brendan. We have talked about mics probably a dozen wow. times. I know, I know. <laughs> but the ones we have are working well. They worked well for the live videos. I wanted something a little more crisp for, like, the recording videos. Yeah. All right, this one's for Ashton F. Order number 138174. Some Hobonichis and uh, Pilot Kasumoso ink. 
Please poll on TikTok Live. I enjoy watching the lives. This is my first time using a Hobonichi, and I'm very excited to try poll. It's in pilot So let's go ahead. Yep, and we've got him here in the live too. Ashton, what's up? How we doing? So you're getting the Kosu Mosu, I think that's how you pronounce it. And then let's head to our land to grab you the Hobonichi 85 Cousin Dreaming Soda. Should be the light blue one. Dreamy Soda. That's that should be the cover. It. And then you're doing the English A5 Cousins book. Should be this one right here. And then the Techo A5 pencil board. Look at that. And that's gonna do it. You got a great setup. So just to show everyone how this is, if you don't know, Hobonichi was offering the ability to purchase the covers. So you put the refill in there. You close it just like that. You can put the pencil board under any page you're writing on in the cover to give you a more stiff writing experience so you're not um, using like a fountain pen that will mark up the following pages. Yep, and can you close that back up? And then most of these covers do come with pen loops. That's how you close it. You got one on the front, one on the back, so you can put your pen in there to keep it uh, sealed up. Yep, pretty cool setup. Enjoy. A lot of people, once they get into the Hope Nietzsche, they never get out, so welcome. Yeah, Philadora commented, Hope Nietzsche twins. They must nice. have the same. I don't know if they have the same cover or uh, just doing that A5 Cousin. So excited. Thank you. Uh, Brian, if folks want to see the sub before Friday, I put it in the Discord. Awesome. Thank you. I really hope uh, you use the spoilers tab. Yeah, hopefully. Because that would be a good example of when to use a spoilers tab. Yeah. And so just quickly, a lot of people have been asking us to post photos of our previous sub boxes. I think I'll start doing that because people are really missing out. So maybe I'll make a post on Instagram of the previous boxes that we sent out to give you an idea of what you can expect. Go ahead. What are you going to say? No, that's just going to comment on Discord to uh, just remind everyone. I know you did at the beginning of the live. But to, uh, we've got a few more people in here to join the Discord server if you haven't already. It's a great place to see all the new upcoming products, get some spoilers, but also just to interact with the uh, the pen community. Tens of other in addicts. Yes, it's a great place. We're seeing so much uh, interaction there. We're learning quite a bit about products that we didn't know about or how to use things. So it's uh, always more out there. That yeah, it's been pretty about. cool. Very enlightening. So. Yep. Uh, before we go into the next one, Kelsey has a question. Uh, Brian, when does the English A6 come out? I've been waiting for my order. Uh, so we. On? No. Uh, those. Uh, I don't think that's what she's talking about. There's an A6 English refill that is supposed to launch at the beginning of November. Our order was confirmed. So early November, it'll go up for sale. We've got quite a few on order. Cool. All right. So this one is for uh, Carrie and Chase. Brendan, please pull my order live this week. My son absolutely loves you, and I'd love to surprise him with an autographed sticker. I love your store, and we are huge fans of your videos. I must say, I'm thrilled that my 17-year-old son, Chase, uses fountain pens daily at school. I have to give your videos all the credit. Thanks for making my kiddo love the hobby. Thanks, Carrie and Chase. Well, Chase, that's super cool. You're way ahead of the curve using fountain pens that early on, at least here, and I believe you guys are in the States, correct? Yeah. So congratulations on joining the hobby early. You're way ahead of all your friends who I guarantee you will join the hobby later on in their life. So this one's for you, Chase. How fun. I'll make sure to sign a sticker for you. No problem at all. Uh, but we got some great pens on here. Two Lebons, one Estabrook, some inks and some stickers. So let's get it. Uh, we'll grab the stickers first. This is the storefront, the Hollywood caricature, and the turquoise stick. We're actually working on a couple new sticker designs that you might have seen already, but uh, we just got to get them printed and ready to go. So here's the crispy storefronts, the Atlas nib, and arguably the greatest sticker of all time, the Hollywood caricature. Boom. I'll make sure to sign this one too. We need the Robert Oster cherry blossom, Australia's oak. We got a million of these bad boys on the shelf. Cherry blossom. And the last bottle of Australia's oak. 
All right, then we need to go to the back. Two Lebons, one Esterberg. And as we're going back there, I did want to point out, Ray got a Hobonichi Han A5, which is a brand new uh, addition for Hobonichi for this year. And uh, since it's brand new, I'm be really interested to get some feedback once uh, people start using it. So if you've got one for this coming year, please let us know how you're liking it so far. It's a new hardcover A5 size, uh, but it's all in one instead of having a cover and a refill separately. And for the, uh, the honeycomb flex fine nib with gold right here. Wait, that's ebony. Let's see what's back. Fine, medium, broad. Hold on, which one was it? Flex Extra Fine, my apologies, which is right here. So we'll open that one when we get it back up front. And then right behind me, we need the Aqua Lagoon and the Sakura Laban. Yeah, and it looks like Kerry took advantage. Uh, in the last couple of weeks, we did start adding all the specialty nibs for Estabrook uh, at the request of a number of customers. Uh, so we have most of them in stock. All of them except for Tanya's request for the sea glass in silver. But most should be in stock or in transit to us. Uh, but we have, I want to say they have nine or ten different nibs available now. And we're going to start carrying those regularly in all of the Estabrook Estes moving Whoa. forward. Uh, here, you can start seeing we're getting ready for the Diamine Ink Vent shipments. Okay. We've yeah. got hundreds of... Uh, orders that will be going out here in the next couple of days. And circling back to the uh, additional inventory on Estabrook, Brian said it was customer recommendations, but that was from people in our Discord server who were communicating through our platform directly to us. And, you know, it just, we see things a lot easier all under one roof. So uh, it was really cool to see everyone kind of pile on saying that's what they want. And then, you know, we make it happen. First Laban Aqua Lagoon, this is the 325 with a fine nib. Beautiful pen. Next one is the Sakura with an extra fine nib. And I do want to make an announcement about these Lebons. I'm not sure when we're going to be able to get more in stock. Uh, they were having an issue with U.S. distribution. Uh, so we'll have to be importing these from now on. So it might be a little bit before they're restocked here. We do have most of the colors and nibs available right now. But if there's one you're eyeing and you want it this year, I would make sure you grab it soon. This is the Flexi. Just in case, because uh, it might not be back until sometime next year. This is easily one of my favorite ball pens, if not my favorite. I mean, just look how well designed that. Yeah, and there's a funny story behind this. This was a special edition a couple of years ago that we thought went, went away. Mm -hmm. And uh, when Carrie would come, with Estabrook, and we keep seeing it in his case, and we'd ask, like, how do you still have these? They uh, converted it over to a special or a regular edition. Yep. We were able to restock it, and that's bed that and one or two others, but uh, are definitely the best sellers. All right, and that's gonna do it for Carrie's order. So we've got the Atlas card, and then. Oddly enough, one of the few stickers you didn't order, so that'll work out well. And then I'll make sure I sign uh, the Hollywood card off camera. I gotta find a better marker than what we've been using. Uh, last video, if you caught it, I accidentally stained our shipping table really badly. So um, we'll make sure that we get that off camera. But thank you so much for the love, Carrie and Chase. Keep doing what you're doing, that's super cool. Yeah, Tanya, a little offended. Uh, I had to make a choice between honeycomb and bolt. Nibs, it came at the expense of the sea glass silver trim. Nice. Sorry, Tanya, you can't win them all. This one's for Dorothy C, order number 138245. It's going to be a quick one. And Ego from Twisby and a Traveler's Notebook. Here. Yep, blue. What can you tell her about the wraparound hole? Yeah, I love the nibs. Yeah, I love the nibs. Yeah, I love the nibs. 
Yeah. 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 Y
Okay, I'm now ordering a Ripman orange broad nib. Good choice. Yeah, it really pops with that black nib. These videos are working, huh? Great. Okay, this one is for Austin H. Order number 138075. An ST DuPont, Line D Large Guilloche, and a Robert Oster $10 note. Gold. A lot of love to our our Australian friend. Uh, thanks for all that you do at Atlas. Got a raise recently and decided I'd finally get one of my girl pens. Would love to yes. see my order pulled on TikTok. Well, congratulations, Austin. No better way to celebrate than a beautiful ST DuPont pen. And would you like to share the uh, the amazing promotion we got on those? Yeah, Pretty is wild. it on this one? I didn't see which color it was. Yeah, it's the ruby. Ruby, okay. So we have five or six of the original SC DuPont Line D Large Guilloche pens on Last Chance, which gets you an extra 50% off of the current call price. Uh, so all you have to do to take advantage of that is use code LC50 at checkout and you will get that extra discount. You guys gotta see this pen. This is one of my favorite setups. And we got Aurora right down there, retro. I, this is one of my favorites for sure. Super fun. Kelsey is giving the advice to go with that pink Ritma. It's a roller ball. So we'll have to reach out to Monteverde see if we can get that done. This isn't the one we need. Hold on. Oh yeah, the pink Ritma. That'd be cool, like a soft pastel, pastel pink. Yeah, Anna's saying that we can't hear you very well, so I guess we just gotta make sure. We don't Talk have mics on right now, because uh, they weren't working. This one. So we'll do our best to talk as loud as possible. Brian broke them. Tragic. I don't know. I think you were the last one to use them on Friday, so. But the show must go on. That is an awesome pen. That's a fine right there. Yeah, this thing's beautiful. Tanya, any word on Pelicans? Uh, I'm they, guessing shipped, they shipped on Friday. They were a little delayed. From Germany? They shipped from Germany on Friday, yeah. So that means they are they would have shipped air, so that means they're, they're in close. the U.S. Uh, already, I would imagine, yeah. probably going through customs. So hopefully in the next week or so, we should have them. Yeah, I texted Gary on Friday. Nice. There's also like six or seven new releases that yeah. are coming out from Pelican it's that we have up for pre-order. Yep. Big October, big November. Yeah, and Anna's right. Uh, you just break everything, Brendan. Chipotle line is crazy. Busy day. Yes, sir. Austin, thanks again. Congratulations. All right. Hey, we only have two left. This one is for Andromeda K. Order number 138528. Doing a Twisby and a California Teal. Now they found us on TikTok. I was reading this note earlier, which was super cool. This is my first order. My sister lives in Chicago and I hope to visit when I see her. I found you on TikTok and greatly enjoy your selection. My boyfriend wants a fancy, expensive watch one day and I just want an, expen or an expensive, fancy fountain pen. Thanks for what you do. Have fun. Okay. So let's grab the California first, and then we'll head to the back. Yeah, and anyone not familiar with the Monte Verde inks? Great collection. I think we've got about 50 colors. California teal is by far the most popular. But how much do they retail for? All 10 bucks? 10 bucks. A great way to get access to a ton of different colors of inks. Back to Twisby land. We need to be clear. We're gonna find. Go ahead, Frank. Sorry. And Alan asking, do you sell replacement nibs? The only brand that we currently have replacement nibs for is Lamy. If there's a certain brand you're looking for, uh, reach out to us. We'd be happy to point you in the right direction. Some manufacturers are able to uh, process those orders for you to get the right nib size. Andromeda, thank you so much. Welcome to the world of fine writing. 
Stay smooth. All right, this is it, Brian. This is the last one. This is for Tin Kim L. Order number 138542. Got some inks, some accessories, and note that says hi. It's Tin Kim from Discord. Would love to see my order pulled live when I'm buying some birthday gifts for a friend. Well, happy birthday to your friend. Let's get it. And a note from Tanya on Monteverde. Monteverde inks are wet, match with a dry nib. Yeah, like an extra fine nib, you know? One of my favorites, uh, Autumn Forest. Is that the one that's on here? Yep. This ink is unbelievable. Check it out, you won't be disappointed. I would personally vouch for this ink every day of the week. Autumn Forest from Dominant Industry. Two wearing goals, the Inn of Green Gables and the Great Gatsby. Great Gatsby right here. And this one's a red one, and of Green Gables. And whoa, some ink swatch cards. Where are they at? Uh -oh, we got are they? Cards. They should be ink in like swatch, a white package. Are they with like the other swatch cards that we have? The color rings. They might have made some room because we got so many inks coming in. Okay. Yeah. Let me check. We just do one line. We so because those are just those are the these. bookmarks. Yeah, we need the swatch cards. Yeah, I'm guessing the they might be over in your accessory section. Okay. Uh, hey, can you check real quickly? Maybe just do a quick glance. Uh, Jasmine's suggesting we might have sold the last one just now in store. Oh, wait, we got them. They did get moved over here. To make sure that's the right one. We got them. Yeah, they're not here. So actually, that brings up a great point. You know, sometimes when we're out of stock on some items, um, this is the right one, by the way. Okay. Yeah, swatch card horizontal. Um, you know, since we do operate a retail store six days a week, there is a slim possibility that something you ordered did get sold in the store before we were able to pull it. So sometimes that is the issue that we have when we're reaching out to you saying something's out of stock. Uh, that just means somebody in the shop has great taste, just like you folks ordering online. So perfect. All right, we need the Blackwing Slate Notebook. I think we actually have to go back here. Yep, and uh, that Dominant Industries, for me, had to toss something in the order for myself. Yeah, great color. Well done. Okay. And Ray, uh, from the... What's up? From uh, one of the previous subscription boxes, I love the Purple Mist y'all put in a sub a couple months ago. Purple Mist, was that one of the Mats Verdes? Oh, wait, no. Purple Mist. Maybe it is. That sounds like a Monteverde. I feel like it was a Monteverde. Yeah. yeah, I can't remember. I think it was. Um, but, Tim Kim, that's his name. That's going to be it. That's the <laughs> yeah, I apologize. Sorry to put my order on hard mode yeah. with you trying to find things. Hey, you know what? Got to keep him on his toes. We, we saved it for last. So, here's, of course, the Atlas card and the sticker. Really appreciate the love. I hope you've been enjoying the Discord channel as well. Nice to have you there. Um, so, folks, that's going to do it. Two, four, six, eight, ten today on the queue. Yeah, it's a large one. We haven't Super done that fun. many in a while. Yeah, so that's all we got. Any final comments, questions, concerns, objections? Nope, just um, a big old thank you. Yep. Uh, I'm sure Brendan's going to try to go live on Friday. Yeah, a reminder to. You can. Yep, a reminder to join the Discord server if you have not already. Fountain Pen Day is in two weeks. Diamond Ink Vents are launching this weekend. Frank said they'll be here this afternoon. This so. afternoon, so, yeah, uh, so you probably start getting some shipping notifications tomorrow and Friday on those. I think that's about it. There's something else launching on the 20th, but I can't remember what it is now. A lot of stuff, I don't know. There's always new stuff. Oh, two new narwhals, or novelors that are up yeah. for pre-order today. We didn't talk about that. A couple of big news already up for pre-order. A new one just got announced, so it's yep. crazy. The pen world is in full go time mode right now. So we'll call it fourth quarter. It is the fourth quarter. Good? We're good. All right, folks, y'all know the drill. Stay smooth. Peace.